Right now, there are more than 1,300 computer science job openings in Arkansas, and they pay pretty good money, too, many more than a $70,000 a year. And Arkansas Governor Asa Hutchison wants to make sure students have the skills to fill those jobs. Local 24 News reporter Brad Broders caught up with the governor this morning in West Memphis. 8,000 Arkansas students are now enrolled in computer science courses in schools, and Governor Hutchinson believes they're the key in growing the state's workforce. As I found out today, West Memphis High School students are among those leading that charge. Justin Simpson is just a sophomore at West Memphis High School, but these computer labs are like a second home. It's fun to interact with new things and to learn how to use more new technology every day. He's involved in West Memphis High's computer science curriculum, recognized as one of the most advanced programs in the state. When you do coding and stuff, you're more free to express yourselves because you can create many apps and activities to do. Simpson is exactly the type of student which Arkansas Governor Asa Hutchinson believes can help the natural state thrive in the 21st century. The key to any economy and the strength of it is diversification. Since 2015, Governor Hutchinson has made computer science curriculum a top education priority, and this morning he stopped by West Memphis High to reinforce that message. They changed the economy of Arkansas dramatically because whenever tech companies see the talent that we're producing out of our high schools and our colleges in the computer science area, they say, this is where the talent pool is. We can locate there. After hearing the governor speak at his school, Simpson believes the computer science classes he enjoys today could one day become a career. It got me excited just hearing him speak in general. He has a very nice voice. And also, I'm glad that a lot more jobs will be coming to Arkansas for people to do at home and stay here. Since 2015, Arkansas Governor Asa Hutchinson has visited more than 70 schools. Reporting in the studio, Brad Broders, Local 24 News.